Hello guys, I want you people to watch this video with me. Now this is happening in Tunisia. The black African migrants there are facing, in fact, the kind of, will I say, a xenophobic attack after the Prime Minister of um, Italy visited their president, um, which is uh, Mohamed Said, um, Georgia Meloni is the Prime Minister of Italy. She ran to Tunisia, you know, to end the immigration. That is the sea crossing from that uh, place to Italy now. So the thing has led to a very serious crackdown on um, all the black Africans living in that very country, unlike what we had in the past, okay? So they are now raiding them from house to house. So Libya and Libya has uh, been tough on immigration too. But now this one here in um, Tunis or Tunisia is, I think is worst. Nowhere is safe anymore. So in case they are pushing you to travel um, through this route, just to let you know what is going on. And um, we are not bringing you updates to frighten you or to uh, make you lose hope on whatever you believe just to keep you informed, right? So what this video with me, and make sure you share it to others so they know what is going on because um, anybody who is not aware of all this information that we've been passing, we feel or believe whatever these people who are doing this uh, bogaring or trafficking tells you. They'll tell you, oh, everywhere is good. Within two weeks, you're already in Europe. Meanwhile, look at the real situation on ground. Now watch this and share this video. Don't forget to give a thumbs up or uh, like. Look at Those are policemen, you see. These people are in living houses. Let's watch. What do I doubt some who's on web? What do you do? I mean, I mean, I don't know. 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 I I don't know. I I I Share this video. Share this video now. Share this video. Happening now in Tunisia. So it says house to house manhunt for black Africans takes toll in Tunisia. Okay, okay. 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 Ok
All right, so uh, you guys can see what is going on there. You can see. So this is a very serious crackdown going on in Tunisia right now. They say that in the last two weeks, there has been door-to-door -door and street collection of dark-skinned persons. Even those identified as Tunisians are crammed into police vans and deported to the eastern border regions. Women, men, children, everybody. Nobody is exempted in this kind of crackdown going on in Tunisia now. You see? So the thing has also sparked um, a wide range of uh, protests in Tunisia right now. So activists are also protesting. Uh, today in Tunis, a group of civil society and human rights activists took to the street to demand an end to racism, xenophobia, and deportation of sub-Saharan Africans. Adam T. N. presidency have been producing hate speech and green light for violence. You see? So they have not given opportunity to these uh, African migrants who are in um, Tunisia. You know that Tunisia became a kind of safer route after the crackdown uh, by the Libyan authorities through the help of the um, EU funding and also the um, Italy funding of the police and their coast guard. Now watch this. They are calling for an end to the deportation of uh, migrants Black African migrants. So, with all these things, you begin to wonder what is going on. Uh, are these countries still Africa? Where are the Africa? Where is the African Union? Where is the AU? Where is the ECOWAS? Where is I don't understand because all these things cannot be going on, and then we still have government in place, and they are not even dropping them in safe places. They will just go and dump them in the desert. They are not dropping them in um, okay in another safe region or a country or even deportation. They just take them to the desert which is dangerous. A lot of people have died out of this. Okay? A lot, a lot. This is uh, very sad. Uh, I think I had one video there. If I can't play it now, you can see. Uh, let me play you this. Just take a look. To the city of Bosan, Bogotik, but you can see. You can see. So they are not welcomed anywhere. The racism is too much. So in case you are doing any of this travel, just bear in mind uh, that these are the thing, kind of things that you may have to be facing. Okay, you may face all this kind of... Uh... So these are the people dropped in the desert. This is how they are surviving currently, you can see. You can see. This is nice. You can see. These people were chased out. See? Both children, men, women, everybody. 
if I had a generating heat in the desert, you can see it's getting dark. Look at it. Let's take a look at it. See? This is the condition of people who are currently. Please share this video. Now they share. That's why a lot of people are falling into this trap. Because when we do these videos, you will not share it. You will not share it for others to see. Some people came here unknowingly that things like this are happening. Meanwhile, the burger have collected money and I showed them that uh, the road is smooth. Within three days, they are new. It's not like that again. No. Uh, let's look at the situation of things now. Libya is on serious crackdown. See? So I just wanted to show you this. Share this video and um, awaken others to know what is going on. Oh, yeah, now.